Hey, Snaps, how you been, man? Good to see you, man. Long time no see, man. Man, how you been, man? I got a problem, and I got a problem. What's your problem, Snaps? Man, I was trying to use a liberal amount of force on getting that flywheel off the end of that crankshaft. Uh -huh, uh -huh. And I snapped the end of it off. Oh, man. man. How many green stamps are we talking, Terrell? Well... Uh, you're in luck there, uh, Mr. Hipster. Woo! Uh, because I have a trick for fixing that. You don't have to replace the whole crankshaft. Oh, right. man. Thank you, brother. So bring that engine in and I'll, I'll fix it right up. I'll we'll fix it up real snappy. Woo -hoo. Well, that's just what I wanted to hear, Terrell. All right, I'll be back in a hot minute. Then. All right, Snaps, I'll meet you on back. All right, Snaps done snapped off the end of his crankshaft. Now, there's a real simple fix for that. A lot of people think you just gotta go and buy a whole new crankshaft that you ruin that engine. All you gotta do is cut off the end of the crankshaft nice and flush and try to get a center punch mark as close to the center of the crankshaft as you can. Now, one way of doing that is go buy a set of these here transfer punches you can get these over at Harbor Freight. And then another thing I did is I found a transfer punch that fit inside this socket. And this socket was pretty much close to the diameter of the crankshaft. So I just held that as center as I could on the end of the crank, gave it a tap, and I got me a center punch mark almost dead center of the crankshaft. Now, if you don't have all these tools, that doesn't matter. All you got to do is just try to get it as close as you can and then just drill and tap the end of the crankshaft and then just put a bolt in there with a big thick washer. Okay, as you can see here, I cut the crankshaft nice and flush and it's below the surface of there. See, that's where Snappy done snapped off the crankshaft. That's how it was, it was like that. He snapped it off. And then I drilled a 3 8 16 drilled and tapped for 3 8 16 that's the size I put in there see there's a bolt and there's super thick washer screw that in hammer it down and there's your dinner simple as that gobble it up gobble 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 there's your dinner